What chess opening should I learn? There are many, but 1e4 or 1d4 are the safest to begin learning chess openings. Former world chess champion J.R. Capablanca also suggests this. However, the best opening for you, according to the great Gary Kasparov in the Masterclass, you should base on your own personal playing style. So in this video, I'll explain the two types of playing styles and which openings fit into which style. Let's go. So what are the two types of playing style? The two types of playing style is silent or positional playing style and another is an aggressive playing style. A silent or positional chess playing style is one that focuses on making small strategic moves rather than aggressive attacks. This can be a very effective strategy as it allows you to control the game and make your opponent take risks. So, what are the examples of chess openings that can fall under the silent or positional playing styles? Number 1. The Italian game. 1 e4 e5, 2 knight f3 knight c6, 3 bishop c4. Number 2. The Rui Lopez. 1 e4 e5, 2 knight f3 knight c6, 3 bishop b5. Number 3. Karukan defense. 1 e4 c6. Number 4. The London system. 1 d4 d5. 2 knight f3 knight f6. 3 bishop f4. An aggressive chess playing style is one that focuses on attacking the opponent's pieces and creating as much havoc as possible. This can be a very effective strategy as it can put the opponent on the defensive and force them to make mistakes. So what are the examples of chess openings that fall under the aggressive playing styles? Number 1. The Scotch King. 1 e4 e5, 2 knight f3 knight c6, 3 d4. Number 2. Queen's Gambit. 1 d4 d5, 2 c4. Number 3. King's Gambit. 1 e4 e5, 2 f4. Number 4. The Sicilian Defense. 1 e4 c5. Number 5. The French Defense. 1 e4 e6. So those are the openings in the type of playing style that you can check out. Also, be sure to check out the links in the description for some articles related to learning chess openings. Now let's talk about some quick details about the silent or positional chess openings we just mentioned a while back. Number 1. The Italian game. 1 e4 e5, 2 knight f3 knight c6. C bishop c4. The Italian game is one of the oldest openings in chess dating back centuries. This traditional 1e4 opening can result in both slower positional games and open tactical battles. Although it is popular among beginners, the Italian game is part of the repertoire of players of all skill levels. Number 2. The Rui Lopez. 1e4 e5, 2 knight f3, knight c6, 3 bishop b5. The Rui Lopez, also known as the Spanish opening or Spanish game, is one of the oldest and most thoroughly studied chess openings in history. The majority of the best players in the world have included this rich opening into their repertoire and many of them play it with both colors. The Karakan defense is renowned for its solidity above everything else. Defining move 1c6 is the fourth most common response to 1e4 and almost twice as common as the fifth most common move. It prepares for 2 d5 without obstructing the light squared bishop. Number 4. The London System. 1 d4 d5, 2 knight f3, knight f6, 3 bishop f4. The London System is a common 1 d4 opening for white that has a respectable reputation. White can play the same basic setup against practically all of black's answers. Hence, the London is regarded as a system. Due to this, the theory around the London opening is not as comprehensive as it is for other openings. Real quick before we continue, if you're looking for an easy to follow digital interactive chess book that will answer all your chess questions, go check out our Chess Delights interactive edition of the Chess Fundamentals. You'll get an in-depth lesson that covers the basics, openings, attackings, and endgames, all in a downloadable interactive digital chess book. This ebook is an exclusive edition from chessalites.com and one of its kind. This is the ultimate digital interactive chess book for every skill level. 
And the best part is, you get lifetime update. So once you buy it, you have access to the latest and greatest version for life. So because you're watching this video, you can go to chesterlights.com slash ebook and use the promo code chesterlights to get a 20% discount for the interactive ebook. Now let's talk about some quick details about the aggressive openings we just mentioned. Number 1, the Scotch name 1 e 4 e 5 2 9 f 3 9 c 6 3 d 4 The Scotch game is a centuries old 1 e 4 opening for white and one of the strongest Ruy Lopez alternatives. The Scotch is a fantastic for opening for beginners and an excellent weapon for players of all strength levels. Gary Kasparov was one of the most renowned adapters of this strategy. Number 2, Queen's Gambit 1 d 4 d 5 2 c 4 White's Queen's Gambit is one of the most famous and oldest 1d4 openings. In contrast to 1e4 openings, the Queen's Gambit typically develops its strategic rather than a tactical battle. Despite having existed for centuries, this opening remains one of the pillars of any elite player's repertoire. Number 3, King's Gambit 1e4e5-2f4. The King's Gambit is an old aggressive opening that was reared by romantic chess players. This opening, which has been widely employed by elite players for more than three centuries, generally results in exciting and decisive games that are wide open. Number 4. The Sicilian Defense 1e4 c5 The Sicilian Defense is the most common answer to 1e4 by white. The Sicilian Defense is a respected and positionally solid opening that is employed by both experts and amateurs. Nevertheless, the Sicilian is an aggressive beginning that typically results in energetic and sharp positions. Number 5. The French Defense 1e4 e6 The French Defense is among Black's most common replies to 1e4. Since the 1800s, it has been a staple in the repertoire of masters and a favorite among positional players. This opening is a wonderful option for players of all levels as it typically results in slower games but very aggressive. Finally, if you're still not sure what type of openings you should learn, I suggest you write down the name of the games you frequently encounter and study that opening instead. For example, if you play online like chess.com, you can see what type of opening you're playing and just jot them down and next research the opening and study it further. So if you found this video helpful, leave a comment, hit the like button and subscribe for more quick chess and chess learnings. That is all, thanks again and enjoy learning chess.